everybody welcome back to my channel um, I would have just set everything up um, so that it's like uh, light on this side but I'm way like I realized I was hungry and I'm like you know I'm just gonna make this food I'm hungry so I have this like steak what kind of steak was it um, I don't know it was a steak I don't know let me see the thing is right here what was it? Angus. An Angus steak. And it was really thick. And um, you can see right here. Uh, I Hold on. Let me... Oh, I'm charging my phone, but I feel like I should have a light or something next to me. I am so hungry. <laughs> um, eventually, I do want to have, like, like, a light that's going to help. Ooh. This is awful. I don't know. I'm sorry. Anyways, um, I'm not going to eat the whole meat because it, look how big it is. Like, it was enough for me and Mike, actually. Um, but I'll definitely cut it in half. And I made some sautéed mushrooms and some onions. I'm just cutting the steak in half. Ooh, this is a mess. See, I lifted it on a bunch of... Oh, sorry. Oh, my gosh. I lifted it... Mmm, that's good. Really good. Oh my gosh. Mmm, it's so good. Let me cut it first. I put all this up so it could be like lifted, but I can always do this. I'm just hungry and I'm... I cut the... I'm cutting the meat in half because I don't think I'm... I'm not going to be able to finish all the meat. Looks a little bit more cooked than I would have liked, but... It was a thick piece of meat, so I'm like, you know, I w really wasn't sure how long I should cook it for, but that's okay. I really like my steaks to be, um, medium rare, and it does look like I cooked it a little bit longer than I would have liked, but that's perfectly fine. I put some parsley on it. Oh my gosh. No, oh, I mean, this, yeah, it's all right. I like it a little bit more rare, but anyways... Forget about raising it. I just want to have a bite, okay? Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Ew. Sorry. Chewy. <laughs> this is so delicious. Mmm. Can't believe it. So good. Mushrooms. Yeah. And these onions taste really good on it. I got a little Worcestershire. And I also roasted some Brussels sprouts. Mmm. Mmm. I love mushrooms. Mmm. I put a little bit of a glaze on the um, Brussels sprouts with balsamic vinegar and um, honey. I have some, uh, and I didn't really season this, I just kind of like, I put the steak on the cast iron, and I just, um, look at that. Um, and then I covered it, you know. Mmm. 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 My goodness. This is so good. I don't really need this, but I'll put a little bit on top. Mmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. So good. Mmm. Mushroom. I'm sorry, I didn't turn the fat off. The fatty parts of Mmm. It tastes so good with the mushrooms and the onions. I better trim the fatty part off. Mm. So, I really didn't season it much. I just put salt and pepper and some garlic powder. A little bit of fresh parsley, you know. I put a little bit of um, Goya seasonings on it. 
And on the Brussels sprouts, I put some, you have Goya seasonings on it. And I didn't make like a starch, like, you know, I didn't make um, potatoes or nothing like that. It's just fine with vegetables, you know, but check that out. Mmm. I like seared it, you know. I put kosher salt on it. Kosher song and whatnot. So good. Mm. It's really good. Yeah, you don't need um. Mm. Mushroom. I still have all that other steak meat, so I can make something with it. Cut it up, make a stir fry with the Brussels sprouts, you know. I just had this as a sparkling water, it's the Fuji Apple, this stuff. It's like, kind of gives the illusion that it's soda, but it's not. Except this is actually kind of flat. <laughs> but that's okay, it's water, you know. Oh yeah, that's flat. <sighs> Sorry, it's not soda, it's Fuji water. I mean, it's Fuji apple, but it tastes weird because it's flat. So it does whatever. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. So good. I'm really not sure how long I cooked it for, but. Mmm. Ah! I knocked all these pieces off. Oh my goodness. Hmm. And the vegetables are so good. Vegetables. Look at this. I need to get better camera so you can actually see how good this is caramelized and nice. You know. Mm. I love Brussels sprouts. I just like roast them in the oven. Mmm. Uh, like 400 degrees at like 20 minutes or whatever 18 minutes until it gets that color and I put it made a little glaze with um, balsamic and honey and I put it on the stove top you know and just drizzled that over it vegetables can really fill you up you don't need a mashed potato to go with it, or a baked potato, or starchy stuff. Is that like the keto diet? You know, where it's just some kind of meat with like a vegetable? I don't know. I've been reading a lot of things about the keto diet. You can't eat fruits and stuff. And it kind of makes your breath smell, or your lady part smell. I saw that on Facebook. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but anyways more meat. Mmm. I love the little tidbit end. The brown parts, you know. Mmm. Mm. Um, so good. What did I do today? Well, yesterday. I <laughs> Today. And I say, well, yesterday. Is this even working? I get so nervous about this, like, software if it's still filming or if it stopped yesterday my cousin had um my aunt Suk she's Korean she made she just made regular I don't know if it was Bugatti Bugatti mmm mmm that little end that little crispy little end of that steak you know what I'm gonna do tomorrow I'm gonna cut it up into really small pieces and I'm gonna brown them up and like really flavor it. Cause that was so good. This was all just fat. Um, that part was so good. <laughs> oh. It was really nice. And I put some butter on it. I, I had butter melt on it, you know? 
so we had um some vegetables and stuff and you know we had dinner there they always have dinner parties which is nice mike came so we didn't really stay too long excuse me um uh, but I love vegetables. I have to eat more <laughs> of them, you know. Mm. I'm gonna save some of the. Well, I have more onions to make tomorrow, so I can get another piece of the meat. But let me go get another little sliver. Okay, I got a sliver. There's things I'd like to talk about, but right now I'm just trying to finish eating. You know. Yeah, so today. Mm, what did I do? I've been feeling really low energy. Like, um, tired. I, I actually got around to cleaning my house, surprisingly, but. Um. Mm. I wasn't going to. Sorry. Daddy. People on my, that freaking um, food haul thing I'm, I did, they're so mean. I keep getting mean comments there. <laughs> like, they're just mean. Meanies. <laughs> um, I feel like low energy. Because I had my thyroid, um, I ran out of the pills, so I haven't been taking them for like three weeks, and I really feel weird, like no energy and tired and uninspired and not motivated, but I finally actually got around to cleaning my house a little bit, but, you know, usually I'd go get like beer or whatever. I drink a couple. I'm not. I'm not even gonna drink. Plus, I don't want to drink. And tomorrow I have an appointment, anyways, with my doctor. And I also have. I'm gonna get a haircut. Even though I really do like my hair, I don't want it to be long. I'm gonna get do something with my hair. Just trim maybe a couple inches off, just to even it out and make it look healthier. I was thinking about dyeing it, but I actually like my color, so I'm not really sore. Sorry about all those notifications. They're really loud. Mmm, it tastes so good with the um, balsamic, like, reduction or whatever. I really like vegetables more than I like. I could become vegan. What the heck? Oh, yeah. Wait. I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry. Mmm. Oh, it tastes delicious in that um, balsamic. It really does. Mmm. All right, Saturday night, uh, me, me and Mike went out to this really good restaurant. And it was, it, the way it was decorated was, like, so, like, gothic and, like, um, haunted house and all that. Um, it was really cool. <laughs> and we had a black, I had this really good drink called, um, it was, um, a smoky lavender lemonade with elderberry vodka infused with like lavender or something. Tastes like incense and like essential oil, but it was so good. I really would like to recreate that drink. And I had one and I felt nice and warm. I mean, it just, it was really good that drink was. And so with the burger, I had a black and blue burger. I wish I could have filmed it though, but I didn't want to be too like weird and like film inside a restaurant, you know? Um, but I did take a little bit of video, so tonight I'm going to work on those videos and edit it together, but it, it's not a lot. It's going to be on my personal, um, YouTube channel. Because I feel weird about filming inside of a restaurant, you know, even though I wish I could. I need to get better cameras and whatnot, but this is so good. I love Brussels sprouts, you know, especially with this, like, glaze, and I, I really like it caramelized. Oh my goodness. <laughs> You know, earlier for lunch I had chimichangas and the kind that like you microwave, like the frozen kind. And I'm like, Ugh. I'm gonna eat healthy. You know, I gotta start working out and whatnot. Mm. 
This is so good. Look at all this. Caramelized. So delicious. Let me eat it with the onions. Mmm. Ooh, it's so good. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Oh. Mm. Tomorrow I'm going to make I saw this recipe on Facebook. I have a, a Facebook group called Recipes and every time I see something I share it to the group. And Mike was like, make this. It's French onion meatballs. So I'm going to make that tomorrow over egg noodles. Mm. I'm full. That's all the fatties. Don't yell at me. I have enough people yelling at me from that one thing, you know. Uh, mm. Hopefully this recorded it all because if it didn't, I'm going to be really mad. Mm. So I have some meat for tomorrow. Um, I wish I didn't cook it well done, but... This is good, but it's flat. I, I got the other flavors too, because, you know, this is stuff is good. It's water. And if you'd like to have a soda with your meal because of carbonation or whatever, I recommend getting one of these things just because it's like, it's flavored and it's carbonized or whatever. But yeah, that's flat, so it's kind of like not that great. I don't know why they gave it in such a big bottle. Like, for me, I'll drink a cup like that, but then after a while, a couple of days, just like soda, it gets flat, you know? But you could drink it flat. It's not, like, weird. It is a little bit weird, but... So, that was, like, a pretty good meal. And, like, you know, yeah, it was really good. Um, next time, I think maybe I get a smaller um, thing of steak. So, it's a little bit more crispier, you know? Um... Because that was a thick piece of steak, and I didn't know how long to cook it for, so I think I overcooked it a little bit, but that's okay. <laughs> Anyways, um, thanks for joining me. Maybe I'll make another video. Um, I have, like, a couple beers in the fridge. You know, like, maybe I'll drink a beer and make a video and update y'all, but we'll see, you know. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. I gotta... I got like some onion that fell on my laptop and I gotta clean it off. Anyways, <laughs> thanks for watching everybody. Now I have to clean up. <laughs> Bye.